Raise your hand if you've heard of a ping before. Okay, yeah? All right, are people who've got their hands up, in what context do you hear the word ping? Internet. Okay, internet, gaming, command line, I heard someone say. Command prompt. Okay, command prompt. Okay, all right. Wait, 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 wait. Ricky, can you say that again, slowly and clearly? Say it again. Okay, all right. I think you actually said something a little more colloquial than that, but I'll, I'll go with what you said. So what's going on? So he, here's a phrase for you, okay? Let's just unpack what it means, and I think you can see what it has to do with communications systems, right? And then we'll get a bit more of a formal definition of what this is, okay? So here, mm, I suppose this is being used as a noun, right? Okay, so ping as a noun. What does it mean? It refers to a time. So this 999, um, usually it's measured as milliseconds, okay? Usually. Okay? And the larger the time is, <laughs> the slower a system or a player or a terminal or a node is, okay? So as a noun, it's a period of time. We measure it in milliseconds. So 999 uh, would be, I guess that's like one second, right? Okay. Now, that's the sort of colloquial use of the word, right? And if you're on the same network as someone, you'll have a really, really small ping, and people are like, wow, I have a really little ping today, that's a really good thing, okay? Um, sometimes, rarely, you can get zero ping, uh, but usually, like, pretty good is sort of in the... A two-digit ping is pretty good, okay? Now, where does it actually come from? Well, or what does it actually mean? The noun comes from a verb, right? Ping actually means it's a process that you do. Right, namely, it's calling for a response. Okay, it's, it's going to someone and saying, hey, are you there? Can you talk to me? Okay, now I'm going to give this a go. Uh, I'm not logged in as the administrator, so there's, a, there's every chance that it's not going to work for me. But I'll give it a go, okay. Let's try it, shall we? Um, uh, okay, all do. okay yeah, bingo, all right. Oh, uh, no. Well, yes and no. It's that sort of... Destination that unreachable is the part Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Okay, all right. So what are we looking at? Number one, this, um, this black and white sort of um, dark art sort of thing is called a command prompt, okay? Um, not that that's the point, but what it lets me do is it lets me input commands to the computer, hence command prompt, and I enter them in text. Believe it or not, once upon a time, all computer games looked like this. I played this game called Zork, Z-O-R-K, and the whole game was like this, and you, you had options like, go to the left, or go east, and like, pick up a flask, and you know, find a map, and anyway. It was very entertaining for my generation. <laughs> that was interesting. Okay, now, uh, I was playing around with my display settings, that's strange. Now, what, what, what did I do here? Have a look at this um, phrase here, okay? So, ping is, is the command that I put in, right? It's a verb, right? That's why um, it's a verb that I'm calling for a response. So, what I can do, after ping, actually, I'll give you, I'll show you really quickly. So, this, this command, this program, has all these different options for things that I can uh, go to, things that I can specify. There's a long list. Anyway, I'll come back up to what I actually did. I want to go to this address, right, and ask for a response from them, okay? So you can see what's happening here. It says, I'm pinging this website, www.google.com, with 32 bytes of data. So I'm sending something along that's asking for a response, okay? Now, you might also notice that I've got these numbers in here. What are those? They're IP addresses, right? So all of the computers and servers on the internet, they speak in terms of numbers, right? Much like you would say, um, rather than saying uh, a Clavier's house, you would say, you know, 17 to 31 Felton Road, Carlingford, okay? And even though that might seem very strange to someone who's outside from the country, that actually means things to me. And I assume he doesn't live in school, by the way, if you're following. Anyway, then what happens? Now, in between here, unfortunately, I would have liked it that this would have worked, but it's probably because of the proxy. Uh, it says there's a reply from, and then there's another computer. Okay, and I can almost certainly guarantee that this computer here is the proxy server sitting up in the library. Okay, and it's giving us a response. So my my ping, my message, my my call for a response, went through a few steps and got to here, and it said, "Nah, sorry, not letting you out. Um, 
I'm not permitting, do you remember the firewall we looked at, that video, okay, it's not letting me get out and get a response, okay, so that's why it says destination net unreachable, okay, so therefore, what happens here, ping statistics, um, packets, which you remember, they're just little bits of data, right, I sent four of them, um, I received four back, none of them were lost, they didn't disappear, but they were returned to me by someone who I wasn't actually wanting it from. So you can go home, okay? Uh, open up the command prompt at home. You may want to jot this down, okay? Um, under your start menu, you can't see it on this one, but you look for something called run. If you can't see it, if yours looks like this, just press down your Windows button and R, R for short for run, okay? Let's CMD in the search. Oh, yeah, that'll do it, I yeah. suppose. Oh, anyway, if you, do, if you do it this way, you'll look like more of a, um, a more pro, right? So this is what's called the run dialog. It'll let you run any kind of program that's on your computer. And I put in CMD, which is short for command. Okay, when you do that, this will come up, and you can ping Google and see what happens. What will happen is in here, it'll respond, and it'll say, look, here's your packet back. Okay, sorry? I can't ping your website. Can you ping any website? Yeah, I can, but not yours. Oh, okay, I'm special. Okay, oh, anyway. Um, so it'll actually return the packet to you, and it'll give you, here's the crucial thing. It'll give you this noun, right? It'll give you the time in milliseconds. It might say 34 milliseconds or 102 or whatever number. However long it took to get that response, okay? So coming back now. Describes what's, what is meant by a ping. It's two things. It's the noun, it's the, it's the time, okay? And it's the verb, which is the actual act of trying to get a response and see how long that takes, okay?